During pregnancy, the benefits of folic acid have been well documented. Now, new research from SFU giving people another reason to take the supplement. Folate, or uh, in its synthetic form, is known as folic acid, is a very important part of child health and development. PhD candidate Josh Alampi, part of a team studying the link between lead levels measured in blood and autistic-like behavior in children. The research published in the Journal of Environmental Health Perspectives is the first to document how folic acid supplementation can help mitigate the neurotoxic effects of lead during pregnancy. So we found that the relationship between lead concentrations during pregnancy and the development or of autistic behaviors when the child were, were toddlers, three to four years old, was stronger when folic acid supplementation and folate levels were lower. The research found in order to mitigate the effects of lead, people who are pregnant, who are thinking about being pregnant, or who are lactating should take a multivitamin with at least 400 micrograms of folic acid. The research also showed that there's no additional benefit past 1,000 micrograms. We took uh, both folate concentrations and lead concentrations at both the first and third trimesters of pregnancy, and we found that this modification, this key result, was especially apparent or a little bit more noticeable when we used the third trimester biomarkers compared to the first trimester biomarkers. Women should always consult with their physicians before increasing the amount of folic acid they take, but most over-the-counter multivitamins or folic acid supplements contain the recommended dosage. The study's findings align with Health Canada's recommendations. Aaron MacArthur, Global News.